Hello, my name is Lok, a member of Team 5.0. Our project is about problem solving, getting information for decision makers so they can quickly provide relief to damaged areas. So every year, the world sees a series of disasters from natural diseases and humans are the individuals who suffer the most. The damage to during the disaster is already great. But what happens after the disaster is even more terrible, like a food, medicine, and a lot of other things. Our challenge is how to help aid providers quickly solve the problem of relief by giving them the fastest and the most accurate information about the damaged area. So, our solution is to divide into three main users. The first users are humanitarian organizations. The second user is the government agency from the community level up to the national level. And the third users are the beneficiaries. People will register and be identified locally. Government agencies and organizations also have their own accounts to log in. When a disaster occurs, people will log on to the website and provide information about their difficulties and their current situation on the website. This aggregate data will then bring information to the government level. The government will confirm the information and synthesize the information and will share it with emergency response centers to activate the relief response. She reviews the state of your quality to apply for relief to your superiors. Then the, the community agreed great to the district, then to the province, then to the national level to ask for relief. Organizations will have a better understanding about the predicament of the country's regions as well as a much more precise picture of the existing difficulties. In addition, they will get an overview about the difficulty areas are and are able to review the country requirements for humanitarian relief reasonably. When relief organizations have been successful, agencies will confirm receipt of relief goods to update the regional statistics. The value of this situation is that information is provided quickly and accurately due to application of information technology, real-time image, and data across all hierarchical working and detailed censorship. With high accuracy, emergency disaster response centers will act with speed and intent. The beneficiaries of our solution are citizens, governments, and humanitarian organizations. People can get re relief cave quickly. The government can save people and gain credibility. Humanitarian organizations can do humanitarian work quickly and save as many lives as possible. So what about the next step? We plan to have authorized, authenticated users to access our website. We create a homepage with an attractive view to everyone, crawling data automatically from many websites about disaster news, searching news, information real-time about disasters in most of the websites, using data mining, data visualization, and clustering data to enhance information. In addition, we will be embedded custom Google Maps with our information as well as automatically updating data to each position where the disaster takes place. Ensure that UX UI gives a good experience to see useful information image about the disasters, customized for the needs of the other Asian nations and the AHA Center. The content section includes two main parts. The first part is map and data statistics. When we click into a place on the map, we will see basic information like names and descriptions. Some images of the disaster prone areas which are updated constantly by the real time. The chart section displays detailed data 
move to the next one is the news section which shows an outstanding news about the natural disaster in the world updated automatically from famous and reliable websites. When we click into view all button, it will show the page which display news of categorized specifically about the natural disasters. If the user haven't got any account, then click inside up button. It will display a registered page, include general information such as name, gender, phone number, email, country, etc. Then click in sign up and log in in the system to register accounts. To the first group user, which is residents, they will provide information relevant to disaster prone areas. Situation available essential grocery and to the second user group, which is the government, they can see assistance request from their residents. It can be demonstrated by chat. The next button lead to a form summarizing the need of residents on table show commu commodities in stock as a result. They can create a form to send assistance requests to the humanitarian organizations able to have. Click Ghost button to come back to homepage to the touch user group which is HHA organization, they will see the list of assistance requests from countries and then see the detailed information of each request and send back about the possibility of chance to assist those countries.